Are you still in love with Mitch Blake? Mitch Blake is like a time bomb in your life ticking away. If you hadn't connected this year, it would have been next year. You got a lot of honest thinking to do, Rachel. So have I. trying to understand what oh, this time I think you've really gone too far I repeat what don't you understand I have new evidence about Vince McKinnon he didn't do it no I'm the one who doesn't understand he didn't throw the knife dad you have evidence of that yes at the time you were stabbed he was walking his dog that was his alibi that's the truth I have a witness who's gonna swear that she saw him I see. Well, if that is so, it would certainly throw a new light on things. If it was so. A witness. Ready to swear she saw Vince walking his dog. Who is this witness, Scott? Who? Uh, a name. I, surely there must be one. I can't give that out. Don't you think I deserve it? If, if it slipped your mind, I was the victim. Were you? What are you insinuating? This whole thing has just struck me as being a little bit too neat. Neat? Yeah. You mean you think it's a setup? I didn't say that. No, but you think it. You think I set it all up so I would get stabbed and risk my granddaughter's life in the process? All I am saying is that Vince was nowhere near you when this happened. You're my son. Perhaps not biologically, but I raise you and you owe your life to me. Does that mean I don't tell the truth? Where are you going? This time, you are not going to get away with this. Don't you turn your back on me. Get your hands off of me. Don't you ever grab me again. The young bull finding his feet, eh? Someone who won't be pushed around anymore. So Vicky is right. You've gone over to the other side. Over to the McKinnons. I just want to make sure an innocent man is cleared. Whatever evidence you have, the fact remains. Vince McKinnon has threatened me several times. Someone tried to kill me and Vince has taken off. Disappeared. No one knows where. Now I ask you, why would an innocent man do that? Maybe he's afraid of getting railroaded. Maybe he doesn't have the money to hire a big shot attorney to defend him. You, like, after you were done with him, he wouldn't have a chance. I don't want to destroy the man. But I don't take kindly to having a knife stuck oh, in my back. this is nauseating me. You have this blood feud with McKinnon, and everybody in between suffers from it. Then talk to McKinnon about it, if you can find him. I'm going to find the truth. Not because I want to hurt you. And not because I want to find you guilty. If I don't find the truth, me and Cheryl will never have a chance. 
Is it worth turning your back on the family? I love her! I love her! Can't you get that through your head? Do you have any idea what it's like to love somebody? Reginald? <laughs> <laughs> that really warm thing happened today. It was a day much like yesterday and the day before yesterday. <laughs> like this isn't really like you. Now why not? Crazy? Passing a pleasant hour, talking to people I like. In fact, this is what I should do more often. How's about another shot? I don't need one. Are you cutting me off? Yes. I am not drunk. I know, and I'm going to make sure it stays that way now. Well, perhaps you're right. I think what I need, it doesn't come in a bottle. <laughs> What's wrong, honey? Hello, Rose. Mac, how did you find me? Through your secretary. Doreen said you'd be with your daughter at the Northwoods Inn. I'll have to give Doreen a raise. <laughs> <laughs> Drinking? Yes. It was only a couple of glasses, but they were shot glasses, Rachel, and it was straight whiskey. Why did you join us here? I think... I'll do exactly that. Listen, I think you better come and pick him up. Is that okay? I'll be right there. See you in a few minutes. Mac? Wait, Ma Mac? Oh, no! Nancy, what happened? I just called Rachel to have her come over here and get Mac, and he just left. Oh, wait, maybe he went home. Mm, I don't think so. Well, what makes you say that, Cheryl? Because I ever heard him on the phone saying that he was going to Northwoods Inn. <sighs> what is going on here tonight? Everybody's crazy. 